This guy right here is the only comedian here without an STD. <laughs> That's because he doesn't get pussy. <laughs> get back into this right here. Matt Bernoud! <laughs> it's funny because it's true. <laughs> Do you think Jesus hates his job yet? I mean, he never shows up anywhere cool. I mean, he only shows up in like, like, grilled cheese sandwiches, or like oil stains on the floor, or like anything like an obese redneck would own, you know, like, how come he never shows up in anything sweet, like a fucking fighter jet, or like a hot girl's titties, you know? <laughs> it's just like, I was looking at your breasts from afar, and I noticed our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jesus showing up when like I'm masturbating or when I'm done masturbating. <laughs> I'm looking at death, I'm wiping out my brows. Ah, oh, that was good. And I look down, it's like, oh Jesus. <laughs> dirty old gym sock, so <laughs> feel free to go. <laughs> Went to the club the other night, a dance club, but I hate the dance club. It never turns out well for me. You know, the music's always the same. It's always that, <laughs> which I, you cannot convince me otherwise that that's just not a fart that's been auto-tuned. <laughs> It's just, the club is the only place in the world where your coolness is judged by the degree of tilt on your trucker hat and how hard you pucker when you take a picture. It's just, it's retarded. Right. It's the club is filled with douchebags also. And like, I have no idea where douchebags come from because you never see them on the street, you know, like contributing to society. They only come out at night. You know, like, where are these douchebags at? You know, just, I think the club is raising them like in a basement. <laughs> you know, like, there's just a giant, like, douche king with, like, lots of nipples, you know? Like, little douche babies nursing on Four Loco, you know? It's just, <laughs> like terminal velocity in the club, like they should bring someone in to like, you know, get rid of them, like an exterminator, you know, so that's what I'll do, I'll come in, you know, I'll look for obvious signs of infestation, you know, empty cans of like Axe body spray on the floor, like <laughs> gallons of like self-tanner just strewn about, you know, and then I was like, well, you know, you got a real problem here, so. <laughs> so what I'll do is, you know, I'll, I'll set a trap. Oh. <laughs> you know, I, at the 
lure them out of their holes first. So what I'll do is, you know, I'll cover my scent, my pretty Patron on my shoes, and then I'll, and then I'll do the douche call, which goes a little something like this. I throw my hands up in the air sometimes. <laughs> we have a serious infestation. <laughs> Shut, 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 shut. They don't care if it's a wrong song. <laughs> You gotta be careful because they do fly into roid rage. So that's why I wear my patented Ed Hardy gloves because anything else will burn their skin. <laughs> I lure them into a cage that says free tribal tattoos. Uh, and then I take them out to the countryside and have them humanely put down. <laughs> Ideally with a shovel. <laughs> dance club area. It's like an STD waiting pool. Every disease comes from there. You know, if I drop something, it's gone forever. I don't care what it is. Wallet, cell phone, keys, baby, fuck it. <laughs> I don't want to reach down, accidentally touch it, and have my arm melt off like it just looked at the arm of the like the Ark of the Covenant, you know? <laughs> Jews, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> what? <laughs> When talking to girls. It's not because I'm scared you'll turn me down, because, yeah, that happens <laughs> every time. But, uh, <laughs> you know, I just, I have nothing interesting to say. You know, I have a boring life, so, you know, I just, I just, I, I, to combat this, I drink, you know, and it's not a real effective method, because when I drink, you know, I think I'm going up to a girl, and I'm thinking, I'm saying, like, you know, girl, your eyes are deeper than the Pacific. But in reality, it sounds like, I'm uh, blue. <laughs> I just start humping her leg. She'll get the message. <laughs> They sound like they're booing, but I think they're saying goon! Goon! That's nice! That could be like your, uh, you know you're a redneck kind of thing, you know? Goon! Because you guys like Matt, you hated him because you're Christian, right? <laughs> 